both of which happen to be gay. Welcome back to um, Louisiana Purchase Gator Time. For three ninety five, you can have a Louisiana Gator Purchase. <laughs> Shit, wait. Is this where I'm supposed to go? Bro, I don't even know where you are. Um, not that way. But. That's the way you came from. But. I mean, okay, oh, go ahead. Right, it is. Okay. I've only played this game once. Hey, that's only one more time than you. I've played this section, like, five times because oh. I wanted to, like, 100% it, and then, like, I moved. So I stopped. Um... Bro, oh, there's these people. It's all real close. All right. Oh, um, so, like, he says, like, if not, we'll say goodbye without a kiss if you don't, like, meet, meet them. And then, uh, if you manage to make th it through all 11 questions without a kissless goodbye, then I will tell you a lot about myself, the relationship I want, and my demanding requirements. What the fuck? I will tell you far, far more than you will see in men's profile on any dating website. Um... Which is probably too much. Oh, this is where the big fucking boar was. What um, do we do about this? So go that way. That way. See that one tree that's like different than the rest of them? Yeah. I think there's fruit over there. That you oh. can like lure him away with. That's there's fruit somewhere. I don't remember. It's not that tree. Did you get all but one already? I don't know. I think you did. Um, you're making me dizzy. I'm sorry. Let's check. Well, see how there's two sides? Maybe go to the other side that you can go up. Yeah, it's just the one. Yeah. So, like, go up to that area and don't go up his way, but go the opposite way. Um. Oh, oh. So, like, he ends his, his, his whole, like, spiel. Sincerely, Reverend William. Right. <laughs> Is he a reverend? You can be... Okay, so, like, my dad doesn't prefer to be called a reverend because, like anyone can be a reverend and like he usually says like crazy people are which like to be fair some of them are but it's just another way to address a pastor because some pastors are crazy D go that way nope nope up them stairs there oh the fruit fruit um fruit salad Yummy, yummy. So, um, we about to get polarized real quick. It's on the bush over there. Oh. Um, Damn, that's a big ass melon. Question one of 11. Oh, he's already following you? Just drop it. Oh, wait, no, he's not. Big boy, isn't it? Come on, motherfucker. Go around him. Go around him. This, like, here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You did it. Thanks, David. You're welcome. Um, what do you think question one is? Just, just in general. Like, what do you think a man would want to ask you? How good at cooking and cleaning is you? Uh, no, it's worse. Oh, no. How do you feel about U.S. President Donald Trump? Oh, no. You have four options. I think Trump is a great president, and I fully support him. Option two. I am open-minded about Trump, and I would like to learn why he is a great president. Oh, my God. <laughs> Option three. I dislike or am disgusted by President Trump and would never vote for him. Option four. Something else. Literally just something else. Real ambiguous. Uh-huh. Some, something else says, we are not a match. Thank you for your time. Good luck to you. Goodbye. No kiss. Oh my god. <laughs> Look. 
Fox! Fox! Hi. Dude, this is cute as fuck. Right? Isn't that fucking adorable? Um, so we'll just go with the first option because he likes Trump. So we can continue through this test and catfish him. Question two of 11. What is your marital status? This one has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine answers. Jesus Christ. Um, I'm just going to put I have never been married. I love this photo. How much what? money do you think he put into this website? Yeah, I don't know, but at the bottom of every page it says copyright 2000 or 2019 and 2020 by FMRG Trust. All rights reserved. You may not copy any text or images from this website without written permission. Photography by Through the Eyes of My Lens with a hyperlink. So we're totally putting pictures of that guy on the screen, right? Um, By fair use, right? Yeah. Okay, I mean, like, I figured... Or at least, like, screenshots of the website. Because he can't just say, you are not allowed to... Well, okay, okay, okay. Website. We're not copying the image directly, and we're not copying the text directly. If we are... Okay, so... Did you figure out that you have to do a puzzle? Well, I did now. Go over to that thing there. And, um, so you know, like, you have that yell button? Yeah. It's also a sing button. What the fuck? Go that way. That's where it went. Oh. It's also timed. See, because it puts that up there. And that will run out eventually. Ah, oh, fuck. It may have. It ran out. How and you can do I have to be to pretty yell close. It? It's it's like a timed thing. So yell and then run over. Is jumping quicker? I'm thinking it is, but it might not actually be. Get up! Just get up! Just I, get up! I'm trying. Okay, I was like, girl, you did it! Yay! Fox. Fox. This bitch cute as hell. Mm-hmm. Are they gonna do it? Are they gonna do it? Are they gonna pet? Are they gonna be friends? They did it. Aww. Um... Mm -hmm. So, question three is, what is your gender history? <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. Um, and there's only two options. Gender history? Yeah, gender history. What are the options? Um, so the second one is something else. <laughs> what a great look I'm getting from you. What is the first option? I am female, my physical body is female, and has been female for my entire life ever since my birth into this lifetime from my mother's womb. I am happy that I am a female. Yeah, that's me. That's me too. That one. <coughs> Bottom corner. Look. Wait, where's the third one? It's over in the distance. It's going to be a run for you. I hate that one. I find it very funny, but I also don't like it. Um, it's somewhere else. I don't remember where, but you gotta explore. What is your gender history? Yeah. Uh, question four of 11. Which of the following best describes your religion and or spiritual beliefs? When I say, in quotes, God, I mean a unique, omnipotent, omniscious being who loves us all unconditionally. So this is where, like, he don't make sense to me. Because, um... Christianity by textbook doesn't have any room for astrology. And these are some, like, really long answers. Damn. Should I read them? Yes, you should. Okay, so the the bottom one's something else. Um, 
And like anytime you hit something he doesn't like, it sends you to like goodbye with like a kiss or like goodbye with like no kisses for you. I don't know. First one is I don't believe in God. I believe in science. I am either an atheist, parentheses, who believes no God exists or agnostic, parentheses, agnostic, parentheses, who, who does not know whether God exists. I believe that Jesus, Buddha, I, what the fuck? I believe that Jesus, Buddha, and Krishna, parentheses, if they actually lived, were historical figures who made claims that are either false or cannot be proven. I skip over words sometimes when I read, and it really throws me off when mm. I'm down there. I think if you stand in, like, one area, you might be able to get them all. You did it. Um, the second answer is I believe that Jesus Christ was the only son of God. He, I believe that he died on the cross to save us from our sins and that only the path to salvation is to accept Jesus as our Lord and Savior whereupon we are forgiven for our sins. I believe that we only live once and that reincarnation is believed by the Hindus and Buddhists and by some Christians and Jews is a false doctrine. I do not know where Jesus was from ages... 13 to 29, but I reject the idea that he spent time in India with Hindus and or Buddhists. I've never heard that before. Me either. I believe that Krishna and Buddha were historical figures who were not sons of God. I acknowledge that Jesus instructs us to pray in parentheses in the Lord's Prayer, Matthew 6, 9, Wait, and Luke 11, 12. Oh, so go down. No, no, no. Oh. You're over. You're filling in the door. You are making a door. I get it now. Doesn't that fucking dope? That's cool as shit. I forget how beautiful this game was. <clears throat> I love games with perspective shit like that. I'm currently playing Sojourn, which is like a puzzle game with like little story. Um, and some of the puzzles, like I'm, I'm probably close to end game. Like maybe the last two chapters and like the puzzles are getting really fucking hard, but I love it. Oh. You can move those. Like, by pulling them with X. Um, <clears throat> beginning with the words, Our Father, not Jesus' Father, not Our Lord Father. Nevertheless, I do not believe... What the fuck? I am a son, daughter, or child of God. What? That last one throws me off, because, like, for the most part, the one that I just read to you is, like, a pretty standard, like, textbook Christian belief. Mm -hmm. And, like, he's, like, not about that shit. Jump up over on the other rocks. Maybe not. Hmm. Oh, bring it over to the side. See how there's that ledge there? Oh, I do now. And then you can jump up again. Wrong side. Um, so his correct answer is, um, you're spiritual who loves God with all your heart. You believe all sons and daughters. Oh, you believe we are all sons and daughters of God, which like, I think he's trying to say like, you're all Jesus. Did you get lost? I did get lost. Girl, I showed you. Let me see. I'm going to try Just... the other side because I think you lied to me. No, okay, listen. Just listen for a second. Yeah? Go that way. No, like sideways. Okay, now you need to get on the other side of it. Like, you physically need to get on the other side of that thing. Push it against the wall. Oh, that That's, wall. yeah. I'm just dumb. No, you're not. You didn't see what I was showing you. you just go that way. And now you can go upsies. You're lifting, friend. Yay. Um, <clears throat> You believe in reincarnation and karma. Uh, you believe you've lived previous human lives and that your past life karma, both bad and good, impacts your circumstances today. 
You believe that Jesus, Buddha, and Krishna were spiritually enlightened masters who came to help us on our spiritual journey and set inspiring examples of what we can ultimately become in our path. Divine way, if not lifetime, then in a future lifetime. Which is, like, not Christian. You're going to have to move that one. <laughs> 